Hey guys, it's Landon Blake with Redefine Horizons. Doing another video for CAD Management Weekly, our CAD Management blog, video blog. So uh, I'm messing around with spot elevations some more. Got another video where I talk about how you can automate spot elevations in Carlson Survey. In this video, I'm going to just show you how to set up manual spot elevation blocks. If you got some funky stuff that you can't get to work field to finish. Okay, we're not going to do that in Carlson. We're going to do it in BricsCAD, but I've got Carlson Survey open right here. The reason why is I want to make sure that my manual spot elevations look just like the ones that I'm getting out of Carlson. So what I'm going to do here is I'm just going to run the W block command. And I'm going to W block these out into a drawing. Okay, and so I'm going to call this spot elevation manual. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna say uh, I'm just gonna say that for now. Okay, <clears throat> then we can close this. And let's go open up BricsCAD and we'll make our blocks. So we should have a new block in here, spot elevation manual, that we're going to use. I'm going to delete this while I'm in here. All right. Okay, so we basically want to turn this into a block, and I want these to be attributes. Okay, but I want the text to be in exactly the right spot here. Okay, so these should be attributes now, and they are. This is our symbol. Super cool. There's probably a node in there that I don't want. Yeah, get rid of that. Okay, so we just want to turn this into a block. Pretty simple, right? So we're going to block it. And we're going to call this... Um, actually, we don't even have to do that because this is just set up the way I want now. So all i got to do is move it to zero, zero. So I'm going to draw a little line here. And I'm going to put one in at zero, zero. And then we're gonna we want this part right here, the center of that marker to be at zero zero. Okay. This is already set up at a one scale, okay, so it should be good to go. Okay, so we're gonna save that. Okay, and then let's just test it. So we'll uh, make a new drawing here, and we're gonna insert that block. I'm getting tired because I don't remember where I'm going. <laughs> Templates, CAD, blocks. Let's go get that guy. Spot elevation manual. Paste my block in there. It's asking me for the point number. Okay, I'm going to just use 10,000. It's asking me for the elevation. And the description can be ground. And then when we zoom extents, there it is. Looks just like it's supposed to, right? Now, the only thing I don't like about that is I don't want to have to enter that point number. So, let's see. Somewhere in here, there's an extra attribute that I'm not seeing. Let's go to the BricsCAD structure deal and see if we can find that. Block reference, 43, spot elevation... Line point, attribute definition. So it's under this right here. We want to get rid of this. Ah, well, let me get rid of it. Show. Hmm. Let's try and. Fr uh, Alright, so I'll tell you what, to clean this up, I'm going to W block this again. Okay, so I'm going to call this uh, manual B2 because I don't want that point number attribute. See if this works. 
test it out with an insert command. Okay, now it's asking me for the description, ground, and the elevation, 245.323. Okay, so now it's working, perfect, that's what I want. Okay, so, save changes, nope, don't want to save changes to that. Okay, so the other thing I want is, I, I would like one of these that uh, works with a multi-liter. Um, I don't know if I'm going to be able to swing that or not, but we're going to try it. Um, so let's draw a multi-liter. Okay, so we're gonna go from here up to here, and then we'll uh, okay. We're gonna draw that. It's gonna be really ugly, but that's okay. We're gonna we're gonna fix her up. Okay, so we're going to go to our properties, and we're going to make this, uh, we're going to come back and fix that in a second. Uh, let's set our scale, scale should be 1, over our scale is 1, so these are way too big. Uh, this is this is funky because it's set up for like, uh, set up for like metric. So let's do this. Let's close this and open our template. So we don't have that metric baloney. So we're going to open our bricks template. We'll save this. Let go blocks. I'm going to call this spot elevation manual M liter. So this one's going to have the M liter. Okay, then we'll insert that same. Uh, we want to start with that same block that we had. Okay, so we're going to blow this up. Let's try our M leader again. It looks a little better. Okay, so I don't know if I'm going to be able to get this to work with attributes. Um, I do want to put this on a appropriate layer. For us at at, uh, at my shop, it is going to be survey topo text. That's going to be the appropriate layer, and we're going to give it a color. We usually keep our text colors down here. Let's go 45. Get that on the right layer. Run a little purge. And a quick audit. Make sure there's no bugs in here. <clears throat> We're going to save this. Alright guys, and I think this will actually work with a block. Um, I don't know that I need, need to do that, but we could turn these into a block and uh, set that as our uh, content for our multi-liter. Just FYI, I didn't know you could you could do that. That's pretty cool, <laughs> but I don't think I need to do it, so I think this is going to work. So let's just save this, and uh, let's just uh, whip up a new drawing real quick and make sure this works. So this is our spot elevation with a multi-liter. Okay, and uh, it's obviously not set to use the right text text style, which is okay. Uh, but if we explode it, now we got our symbol, and we can edit our text. 
and that's exactly what we want. So, and I don't think, let me see if there's a way this, let's see what textile this is on. It's on standard. I'm going to set it to doses regular. That way when it imports into our drawing, let's try that again. So let's insert, let's purge real quick. Try and insert that block again. Yep, now it's coming in with the right text. Cool. All right, there you go, guys. So we got two kinds of manual uh, spot elevation blocks now. Um, if you hopefully, if, you, if you've got Carlson field to finish, it just works. But you never know. Sometimes you got to drop a couple manual spots, and I've got an easy way to do that now for my team. So. Thanks for watching, guys. I appreciate it.